What up, family? Get the news for a dad swing the the ladies. Today is Wednesday, Wednesday in my city, Chicago. January 31st, 2024. Look, let's talk life and death. For over two generations, almost three generations, I've been trying to, you know, get people to recognize me, not as some um, single leader that's trying to lead the masses and stuff. We are all leaders. That's why, you know, I kept telling people all you had to do was stand up and, you know, you could have been number one and stuff, but they always trying to find one person who they just can't stand or whatever, make people not stand them or whatever the case, get people jealous of them and stuff like Jesus, Jesus and Judas and stuff, Cain and Abel, you know, uh, yeah, Samson and Delilah, I don't know. You understand what I'm saying? Either way, to get the masses to hate one person, they'll be picking out people. For, you know, the white people, whoever, to kill and stuff, you know, and they thought they was going to do that with me. And they've been trying to do it all along since birth or whatever, you know, they ever since they was like, you got to find the next black, black messiah or whatever, you know what I'm saying, and stop them before they, you know, rise or whatever. When we all rose up, Martin Luther King, uh, Jesus, uh, Malcolm X, Oprah Winfrey, Gail, Taraji, Monique, you, me, everybody on TikTok, Facebook. YouTube, you know, Instagram, Young and May, all you motherfuckers and shit stood up and shit. That's why I opened up the market so y'all won't be trying to just pinpoint it and put it on me. But for some reason, people think if they come together, me against the world or whatever, that'd be it and stuff. Y'all better read your Bibles. First Chronicles chapter 14 through 17. Real quick, just read the whole Bible because obviously y'all don't understand how this works. God put it in me long time ago to let me know to tell you all that the world is going to end and as you can see it is ending Martin Luther King said if you go back to business and as usual you'll be in for a rude awakening now if you don't believe these bombs will drop they will drop okay now I look they've done everything I can get it I ain't get nothing out of the deal you think I'm gonna die for nothing at least with the other people like Jesus, everybody, everybody knew who they was, and you know the whole world who out the damn man, you know, I, none of that. You understand what I'm saying? I don't even want to be no fucking leader, nigga. Real talk, cause they kill motherfuckers all day. But because people t been trying to kill me all along, cause they know I am worth something. God made it well. If I die, we all die. If you don't help me, we die. You know, I just did a video on Bob Marley or whatever, and you know they got a song. I got five on it, and I pulled the five and stuff. You understand what I'm saying? That's a gift. A gift is from God and surprise the kid. You understand what I'm saying? Real talk. I tried saving y'all. Y'all didn't want to be saved. You thought you could follow my footsteps and then do it better. Well, you fucked it up. You fucked it up. And God knew y'all was going to try to upstage me. It's Tent City for a reason. Real talk. Chicago. That's my shit. I came up with that. You understand? So people that come up with stuff and they don't want to pay, they slay. You understand what I'm saying? Not this time. It's a different. It's a different world and different energy, and a, you know, different atmosphere. White people going too. Look, it's y'all turn. You either shit or get off the pot. Real talk. You gonna die with me? I'm not going by myself. This the six. I've been doing this since the age of six, 1973. Now I got the Bloods and the Crips. I got the 10 and the White Ball. We're going to do one more just to make damn show. We're going to go over here. You know what I'm saying? Because I know y'all don't believe shit stink. It take two to make a thing go right. Me and my higher power. So if it is me against the world, I got my higher power. And guess what? The world ended a long time ago too, right? And it was only so many people. I think they said eight people was left in the world or whatever. And that's how they, you know what I'm saying, started back. I don't think it's going to be none this time. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. One more. One more. For the haters. Mario Brothers, 1995. You know damn well. Mario Durrell Evans and your mama been stealing my shit since forever and stuff. My writings and things of that nature. You know what time it is. Now fuck it up if you want to. I'm not going by myself. I ain't got shit to do with money, y'all. Prove it. One more time. One more time. This the 11. You understand what I'm saying? Real tough. Deuces.
Peace.